welcome back to Midday Kentucky. Chef Allison Davis here. Wild Time Cooking with Allison Davis is brought to you by Corman Kitchen and Bath. Welcome back to Midday Kentucky. Chef Allison Davis here in the Wild Time Kitchen. And I am talking one of my absolute favorite holiday uh, I don't know what you call it, appetizer or a tort or just a terrain, but this is something that we sell here um, at Wild Time and it's one of our really popular Christmas catering items as well, but I just love it this time of year and it's really the only time of year that I do these, but it is, I call it a cream cheese basil pesto sun-dried tomato pesto terrine had to take me a minute there to think about it but basically what i am doing is i'm making three different spreads and then we're um, layering them in a dish to where it really has these beautiful layers of cream cheese sun-dried tomato pesto basil pesto and then i serve it usually on a platter maybe with some pine nuts on top some basil leaves and then serve that with a nice tray of pita chips and so it's just a wonderful uh, festive look looking uh, dish for the holidays and it's something pretty easy that you can make. So the first layer is I took cream cheese, I let it sit out overnight so that it was a little bit softened. So we took cream cheese and I mixed it with some Parmesan cheese and some garlic, okay? So that becomes kind of our first layer on our torte. So basically we're just going to start layering layer by layer in this dish and then we put it in the refrigerator, let it set and then it uh, comes out and we flip it out and it's just really pretty and holds that shape. All right, so the first thing I'm going to recommend when you're working with cheese and spreads like this, you may want to take a little pan spray on your spreader and that will kind of help you with creating these nice even layers. Second thing in this dish, I wrapped it with a saran wrap and so that's going to help when we flip this out. It's going to be really easy to flip out and um, you know, come out of the dish where it's not sticking. So the first thing I'm doing is I'm just taking my spreader and I'm just getting a nice kind of even layer of that cream cheese mixture. And so that's just the first of many. And then it's going to be a lot of repeat once we get these layers in. So you just want to take it and just kind of spread and make sure you've got just a nice even uh, layer all the way across so that when you flip this, the layers on the sides are just as perfect. All right, the next thing we're going to do with this one is we're going to go in with a basil pesto. Now, I have a basil pesto here um, that I picked up, and then we're going to make our sun-dried tomato pesto. First thing I'm going to say is that there's typically a lot of water in your basil, and so you want to make sure that with your pesto for this dish in particular that you will... Take, make sure that you dry it. And so straining it through a mesh strainer, you're gonna kind of dry it a little bit. So the next thing we're gonna do is take a layer of our pesto and we're gonna spread this on as well. And so then you can see how this is gonna keep coming together. If I don't drop it all on the floor. <laughs> all right, so there is our basil pesto layer. Next thing I'm gonna do is gonna go back over with the layer of cream cheese and then we are going to make a sun-dried tomato pesto. So a pesto is very, very easy to make. I'm gonna add some walnuts for this one instead of pine nuts. We're gonna go in with some sun-dried tomatoes. So I've got some fresh sun-dried tomatoes that I just picked up out of the bag. And then, um, of course, we're gonna add a little bit of garlic. <clears throat> Excuse me. <coughs> a little bit of garlic and some Parmesan cheese. All right, just with a food processor, we're going to blend this together. And then you add just a little bit of oil so that comes together. <coughs> All right, so once you kind of get your paste, you're just going to take a little bit of that olive oil and just kind of let that go in a steady stream until it kind of comes together as a paste. All right, I'm gonna let this blend a little bit together and then I'm gonna let you guys see how we continue to layer this and then we'll show you the finished product when we flip this out. But we're gonna go layer of cream cheese, then a layer of sun-dried tomato pesto, and then back over the top with cream cheese. 
All right, so we have assembled this and we've got all of our layers. And now all we're going to do is just take this. I did put it in the refrigerator um, to let it set for a good, you know, maybe 15, 20 minutes. Um, but then that is where the plastic wrap really comes in handy because you can take your uh, dish right out and then we can just easily, you know, unravel this. And then if we need to, we can kind of clean up those edges. But um, that's the beauty of this. And then I'm just going to take it, put some um, pita chips around, maybe garnish the top. And this is a perfect uh, holiday appetizer for anyone uh, anywhere, if you ask me. All right, you guys are watching Midday Kentucky. You can find this recipe at middaykentucky.com forward slash recipes. I'm Chef Allison Davis. We'll be right back after this short break.